side effects of Mars, and here we have a uh, school that's got national attention in France. It's gotten our attention too. It's an elite school in Paris that uh, had its female students wear the hijab. Students at elite Paris University sparked fierce debate. Wednesday by inviting classmates to wear Muslim veil for a day in a bid to demystify a practice that is highly divisive in France. Yeah, I would think so. Students at Sciences Po urged women to take part in high job day. So I guess it wasn't a school school's idea, it was a student's idea. If you think all women should have the right to dress as they wish and have their choice respected. France is grappling with rising Islamophobia after a wave of terrorist attacks by jihadists. Well, what do you expect? And soon's Facebook page said those agreeing to put on the veil would experience it stigmatization experienced by veiled women in France. So they're trying to make some kind of a point here. Doesn't students hand out flyers at the university by a table covered in colorful headscarves with a sign reading France got 99 problems but high job isn't one, ain't one of them adapted from a Hit by U.S. rapper Jay-Z. They did the same thing here. I did a video on Rochester School 58. It's run by jihadists or something. Or at least jihad sympathizers. They did the same exact thing. And they claimed that it was organized by students. It wasn't. It was organized by the faculty. Organizers Facebook page lashed out at Prime Minister Manuel Valls, who earlier in this month said the veil was being used as a political symbol for the enslavement of women. Uh, yeah, that's what it's for. France has banned full face veil in public places, and Valls said the headscarf was being used by some as a challenge to the country's prize secular society. Comments came after the Minister for Women's Rights sparked a furor last month when she compared veiled women to Negroes who accepted slavery. Mm. I'd say that's about uh, right, yeah. A Sharia Day next, the Sciences Poll Initiative was trended at the top of French Twitter under the hashtag High Job Day drew a mixture of Praise and anger. And it goes on and on. Uh, when is the West going to learn? This is simply an attempt. See, high, high job is a symbol of submission. Or women are supposed to submit to men and all that stuff. Yeah, well, anyway. So there you have it. The West is caving again. They're not going to learn until something really severe happens, apparently. Some of us know what's happening, and we're scared out of our wits. I would say, don't go anywhere near the high job, the jab, whatever. It really isn't about religion, it's about enslaving women. I agree with it, that part of it. I'm on the Facts of Mars. Thanks for watching.